you continuously find yourself in the same exact negative patterns and you're like, oh my fucking God, I can't believe it happened again. I can't believe I did it again. I can't believe this happened again. I need you to just watch this entire video so I can tell you how to escape it so that you never catch yourself in the same pattern again, all right? What's up, winners? My name's Abdul and I'm here to help you develop your fucking life, man. In this video, I'm gonna help you escape this continuous bullshit that you find yourself in so that you can be happy with your life, okay? I'm gonna grab my little notebook here so that I can literally just show you how I fucking did this with my life, all right, in every area. Oh, before we get too far into the video, I do wanna let you know that I've created a five-day free course five days, 10 minutes each to literally take control of yourself and your life. So if you want access to that, go in the description down below and sign up for that on my website. All right. But without further ado, let's get into this. The first thing is that I'm going to read is very simple. Okay. This is the main idea of this video and the thing that you really need to grasp. Nobody else is going to change your life for you. Let me just tell you, nobody, nobody, no, I can't do anything for you. I'm just making these videos because I love making videos and I love teaching, but I can't fucking come into your world and step into your consciousness and step into your body and do do any of the shit that I'm talking about for you. This is where you actually have to take an active role in your life. And again, dare I say it, take responsibility for it. Dare I say, take responsibility. The word that everybody hates. Responsibility. You have to do it. You have to do it. Nobody else can do it for you. It's only you. You're the sole creator of your life. You're fully accountable. It is your burden and yours only. That's it. Nobody can do it. People can support you. People can encourage you. Like I'm encouraging you right now to just be a boss and go handle your own fucking business. But I can't do it for you. So you got to always remember that. Now, all that comes is playing the game. After you take responsibility for it, and you say, you know what? All right. All right. All right. I get it. It's my fucking fault. I get it. All that comes now is playing the game. And the playing the game is very simple. It's all about making different choices until you find the actions, the choices that produce the best result. That's simple. That's the entire game. That's the entire game. If you realize, okay, if I go to bed at fucking three in the morning, I wake up and I feel like shit. Okay. Take responsibility for waking up and feeling like shit and say, you know what? What if tomorrow I sleep at 2 p.m.? I mean, 2 a.m. You're like, oh, well, I mean, I woke up. I still felt like shit, but just less shit. Now you're, now you're playing the game. Now you're like, okay, what if I go to bed at like 11? Now that's a different decision. You haven't made that one before. You try that. You're like, oh my God, I feel better now. Whoa, what if I went to bed at 10? You're just experimenting with your life. You're just making different choices and seeing which one produces the best result. Now, if you don't want to do all that damn guessing, what you can do is realize that there's people who literally study sleep. How to best sleep. What you could do is you could buy one of those books, watch one of those fucking YouTube videos, and they're like, okay, before you go to bed, make sure you take a hot shower, make sure you're fully relaxed, Don't make, make sure you don't stare at any blue light, and you'll get the best sleep. And you're like, holy shit! I don't fucking know that. And then there's this other thing called chronotypes. These are different types of sleep schedules that people have. Like some people can sleep at midnight, wake up at six and feel good. I'm not one of those people. But if I didn't know that that was one of those things, I wouldn't judge you for sleeping at 12 and waking up at six, right? I'm helping you develop the mindset so that you can make better choices. And it's all about gaining knowledge. The only way I was ever, ever able to know what chronotypes is because I watched a fucking podcast. That's simple. Now I know something that you don't and I can make a better decision than you, right? It's not because I'm better than you. I just know shit that you don't. So make sure if you want to really play the game of life and you want to improve any area of your life, you gain knowledge. You just learn about it. That fucking simple. And then you can make the best decisions possible. And that's all the game of life is. Warren Buffett isn't better than me, right? But he just knows things that I don't. Bill Gates isn't better than me. He just knows things that I don't. And so he just makes decisions that I don't make. And that's why we have completely different lives. That's it, folks. Nobody's better than you. But you'll never get to where you want to be if you don't take responsibility for it. So make sure you take responsibility for it. The more radical the choice that you make, the, the overall change and the speed of change that occurs in your life is going to be. So let's say you used to sleep at 2 a.m., right, for example. Or we could choose something that's more in terms of life. Let's say you used to let people walk all over you. For example, like you're a people pleaser. Well, the most radical thing that you can do is whenever somebody that you don't like asks you something, you say no. Instead of saying, oh, maybe later, or instead of saying yes and kind of half-assing it, the most radical thing you can do that you've never done is just say no, fuck off. You've never done that. You don't know what the outcome of that is gonna be. It might be a little scary at first, but you can make that radical cha change and play the game. Right? Remember, it's just a game. Just see what the outcome is going to be if you say no, fuck off. 
And now the other person might be like, holy shit, this person's kind of bossing up. I don't know what to do. And they might be stumbled that you actually said such a response, such a powerful, responsible response. And then now they start to get their act right when they're around you, all because you decided to change. Okay, so this is when you can create this effect, this ripple effect throughout your reality and somebody else's reality, essentially throughout the world, all by you being the best that you can be. You can literally change the world. That's why I created this channel. The more radical the choice that you make in alignment with what you want, the easier and faster your life's gonna change. It may not be really easy. The easiest thing would be to make small incremental changes, but if you want your shit to change fast, make radical choices and be responsible for them. And don't beat yourself up when shit hits the fan or when you fuck up. It's okay. You're just playing the game of life. You're just doing what you know. You're getting better at it. There's no way you can fuck up. The only way you can fuck up is if you quit and you don't do anything at all. And by that, you're definitely fucking up, okay? You're okay. Take it one day at a time and realize that it's gonna, it's the long game here, folks. Like I didn't realize how I was gonna get in this good of a shape with my body until I just did shit for fucking months. That's the only way I got here. If I tried to get as jacked as I could in three months, I'd have to fucking do something that was incredibly unsustainable and I would eventually end up hating doing that. But if you find something that's sustainable, that still pushes you over time, you're gonna have such a great fucking life, man. Just take responsibility for it and just make those choices. And hold on, one, one thing that I fucking hate is, what is up with, with people and not wanting to take action? That, look, if you didn't wanna do anything, why, like, what's the point of being alive? You have an entire body that's literally made for doing shit. And you don't do shit? Are you kidding me? Look, you have an entire physical thing the whole point you have muscles and skeletal cells and it's literally made to do shit use it okay there's people who don't have arms and legs who wish they could walk who wish they could run who wish they could fucking have a body that worked there's people hundreds of kids thousands of millions of kids in hospitals who wish they could just ride their bike and you're telling me you want to stay inside all day and fucking sleep or just be on a video game Although those things do have their place, realize that you have an entire life to live. The point of life is not to be on your phone all day or to play video games all day, unless you made that your life and now you're making bread off of it so that you can support your entire life. But like, look, man, live your life. Live your life. Move your body. Take care of yourself. Have fun. Experience things. Enjoy yourself. All right? I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. If you want to work closer one-on-one -on -one with me and enter into my intentional transformation blueprint, go in the description down below and sign up for an application call. This is literally going to help you change your self-concept so that you begin to take responsibility for your life, so that you begin to literally escape all these negative fucking loops that you catch yourself in, all by raising your awareness and consciousness. This is literally the best course on the fucking internet. And I only have six spots left for the rest of the year. All right, there, my spots are limited. If you want to fucking work with me, now is your chance. All right, I love you guys. I appreciate you. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, like, comment, subscribe. If you want to interact with me on a personal level, go in the description down below and sign up to enroll into my Facebook group. Okay, this is literally a community of like minded people that I've built, that I'm building right now, that I want you to be a part of because we fucking love other people who enjoy growing. If you want to be one of them, description down below. Join the group. I love you, I love you, I love you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And without further ado, that's all, folks.